Shuttlebleed here with another episode of Battletech. When last we left, we had started uh, upgrading some ship things, tinkering with our uh, like our quick draw and stuff, and uh, we were basically just doing the uh, contracts that were still here at Weldry before we kind of move on. This letter of Mark um, looks pretty good, so um, we're going to go ahead and try this. Now, oh, we may not be able to actually. Let's go back. I think we only have okay. We've got we still got four pilots. Good deal. I was thinking that Shadowblade got injured, and so we may only have three pilots, but we've got four. Um, and with uh, kind of this brawl coming up. We've actually got decent mechs to deal with it because most of our people have bulwark. So let's take a look at this. Yeah, the salvage is just atrocious. I mean, we could go like no salvage at all on this one. Max out our, our money here or, or just add some extra rep. But rep is a little less. I don't really care about it. Um, I would like to get a little bit of salvage, but I mean, if you look at the money here, two pieces of salvage for like, if we went to two and eight, two pieces of salvage for like 170 grand, not a chance. So I think we'll go middle of the road here, pick up 400 K, um, maybe get a chance at some, some mech parts, We'll have one that we can choose from, which that's yeah, fine. I am kind of expecting uh, the mechs that we fight here to be still less than what we need, less than amazing, so should be okay, but let's give it a go. Um, I did want to, did I save last time? I don't remember. Uh, I've been having some problems with the game kind of hanging or crashing when I launch missions and so I don't want that to happen um, alright so in our centurion we're going to throw Medusa uh, leave everything else as is and let's go ahead and deploy we did lose we basically only have one person that can multi-target in those so we're going to have to we may have some inefficiency in our firing solutions, but I'm okay. The Restoration citizens have been suffering at the hands of a local band of brigands. Remnants of a pirate battalion saw action in the Third Succession War. Hmm. Oh, it's foggy. Enemies detected in the area, Commander. Move forward and clear them out. Remind these bandits what disciplined mech warriors can do. Should have brought a coat. Yes, sir. All right, guarded and entrenched. Orders. Decker, do your thing, man. Look at that, five pips. On the move. Is that insane or what? That's 50% reduced chance to hit. All right, he's got nothing. So we should be able to move up here. I don't mind moving along the road. Uh, glitch. Let's move you over into the woods. Uh, yeah. Okay. That was a little bit weird. Uh, Decker, again, let's have you moving forward. See if we can get some. We can. Right there. In fact, we've even got sight on him. Uh, damn, we're gonna do this right. 
All right, we got a hunchback. Oh man, that would be fun to get. Um, gonna go ahead and reserve Decker. Holding for the right opportunity. It's my turn. I have to assume he has no pips. I hear ya. So now is a perfect time to rain hellfire on this mech. And so we will. Um, I'm actually going to precision. Ooh, do I want to precision? I kind of do. Because I kind of want to blow up this stupid thing that's got this AC-20. An AC-20 is madness. Yeah. So if we can take it out early, that would be wonderful. It's got 50 points of armor, 60 points of structure. Doubt we'll do it with our... Our, um, like if everything hit that spot, it would, it would happen, but... A lot of stability damage on him. I like it. Oh. Really? Receiving you. Um, that's a little bit strange. What is this? Geothermal. Oh, okay. Oh, what? It must have been this. So we definitely don't want to jump. Uh, Medusa has bulwark, though. Can he shoot him from here? No. Gotta move. All right. Well, if we've got to move him, let's put him in a spot where he can shoot him, but still get a little bit of stuff. Nice. Hit him. Was that a leg hit? Yeah, nothing is moving. I'm ready. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. Not gonna lie. Uh, let's go ahead and move Sure Shot up. I'm walking here. And we're gonna brace him. Oh, now something's moving. Okay. It's okay. I can't see the things, but it looks like they've got a heavy. Right here, maybe? It's this hunchback. It doesn't move until two. Um, so I'm actually going to reserve Decker one more time. No, we got a trebuchet. Good thing we braced him. Reserve him one more time. He's in a good spot. Here comes this HC20. It's a monster. Okay. Commander. Now, Decker. I want you to come over here. Heading 
moving out. Oh man, that armor is almost totally stripped. That's good. We might be able to blow up that ammo. Not quite, but that would be good. We've got a side shot here, so let's... Affirmative. Structure exposed, heat sink destroyed. I think I hit something good. A lot of hits on the leg there. Not thrilled about. Um, yes, Commander. So here's where Decker could like double shot into this guy and hope to do something nasty. Like if we hit that that leg again, we could probably bring him down. But that's not very smart to do with a light mech. And there's all these mediums and even heavies running around. Although I don't think it's a heavy. Centurion, Trebuchet, Hunchback. No. So what we actually want to do... What's he got? LRM, two medium lays and AC-10. Can I get him somewhere out of the way? Out of line of sight? Doubtful. I could potentially get him up here. He would only have... Oh, because he couldn't turn. Man, he could maybe come over and melee him, though. Can I jump him up here further? Yes. This is the play, I think. Can I jump him where he'll have better shots on... Yes. Still dangerous for a melee there. But I think I can't quite see the thing. I think that's as good as we're going to get if we want the 85s. Right there. Let's give it a go. Now I could have sprinted him and got him away safely as well, but I think putting on some serious damage into this thing that can do 100 damage to any of our dudes, or even 50 with the bulwarks, is worth it. Uh, it's too bad I can't precision shot on him, but we've got a good angle on that leg. We might be able to take that leg out. Giving him everything I've got. Yeah, we hit that leg big. That leg must, uh, probably does not have a lot going for it. Missed with something. I'm picking up a new sensor trace. And what Looks is like that? Enemy reinforcements. Enemy reinforcements. Oh, that's not good. That means we got to take these guys out quick. I'm your spaniel. How much morale do we have? Decent here, crappy here. 
But I think we got a bulwark in because I don't I don't know that we're gonna be able to get a vigilance going. That leg is hurt so bad. All right, let's uh, see if we can take him down. See how you like this. Not the best. Oh, we did get some damage on that leg. Did it go Solid out? On that one. Did it go out? No. They got a lock on me. It's okay. The sensor lock doesn't actually just gets rid of the evasive and he's not moving so yep <sighs> ooh that's stripped out too if we can hit one are you kidding me oh my gosh if we can hit him there that well, in essence, just destroy his entire effectiveness. Affirmative. Well, let's hit the completely opposite part. They've got a lock on me. What can I do for you? Come on, Hunchback, you're like, got nothing left. Left torso, left arm, left leg. Knocked down. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't have anything to do with him and he's gonna be able to, oh yeah. Not a chance, bro. He's going to be able to get up next turn. And still fire that stupid cannon. Oh, no, he's not. He doesn't have any ammo for it. We blew up all the ammo. <laughs> he's in a bad way. He's got one medium laser left. All right. I may ignore him for for now. Unless he comes close and tries to... Um, I'm going to go ahead and reserve him. Because I don't... Okay, that looks like an AC-5 and some missiles. Ready for orders. How are we doing? We're still pretty good, looks like. Our arm's getting a little low here on the left side. When remaining stationary, I wonder if that means turning. Can you still turn? Uh, now that we have Vigilance, actually, I think it's time that we move you a little bit. How do you still have, did you move? I guess you did. But. Let's move you up. Rolling. Trebuchet. Like, he's still kind of 
not close enough to do some any real damage. I wonder if I should just brace with him. No, we gotta do some damage. We gotta dish out some damage. Um, am I worried more about the trebuchet or this guy? The trebuchet is gonna have some problems with um, He's going to have some problems. Cover. Provides cover. Okay. With short range. But he still has three medium lasers, which is nothing to sneer at. The Centurion has two medium lasers and what? I can't see it. And an AC-10. AC-10 is quite strong. I think what we should do is something like this. Let's let's go after this guy. I know he's got the stupidness, but I made a mistake. Mistakes were made. I think I will vigilance. And let's just get some damage on this, this guy. I actually got a lot of those to hit, so not bad. Nice. Trying to flank a little bit. I'm okay with that. Um, Good to go. Glitch, I'm going to move you over here. Nope. Glitch. Waiting for orders. Glitch does not have jump jets. Trebuchet does not have jump jets. Good to know. I might just leave her there then. Yes, I think I'm just going to leave her there. Good shots on the Centurion here, so let's... Here we go. Light him up. Very minimal damage. So far, so good. Good to go. Medusa, you can jump, and I'm going to jump you. I want you move. I want you moving over this way. Firing jump jet. Why only 60? Long range, target size plus one, refire plus one. Okay. But if you hit with this, it does a lot of damage. And a lot of stability. Ah, we missed him. No luck. That probably would have knocked him over. 30 stability. What's happening here? Standing by. Uh, hey you. Your center torso has like nothing left. Your rear armor is crap. I believe I will just. However.
say I did this, I'd have some good shots into the side of this guy. But then that, some, that hunchback could hurt me. No, I think I'm going to gonna do a little bit of a crazy move. Yeah. Like down here. Nope. Like here. Yeah. Aye, aye. Oh, but he gets to go before this guy in the next turn. So I could light him up. Except I don't have any sight on him. So I cannot. <laughs> Crap. Alright, let's see if we can take out this uh, hunchback here. All weapons Should be go. able to. Yeah. One less target. All right, Hunchback is gone. Here comes a trebuchet. From fairly short range, but hitting with pretty much all of his missiles. Okay, that's annoying. I think it's because he's a tactician and he's got that minus 45 to range. Standing by. A sure shot here. Oh, he moved. I think the best for him is to stand still so that he can get his bulwark, but I want to see if we can put some hurt on this guy. Get some of this going. Got it, Commander. Structure exposed on something already. That's good. Critical hit, Commander. Might be that center torso. He's really unsteady. Um, I think we reserve with Decker. Reserving action. He's nice to. I, that's the ironic thing is that. They got a lock on me. Light mechs <laughs> tend to be yeah. Oh man, I can't uh All right. You know what? I'm going to actually go With glitch first. Yeah. She has a good chance to do some hurt. Uh huh. Explosions, explosions. He's knocked down. His AC-10 is out of commission. I don't know what this guy's doing. He's just out, out there in the middle of nowhere. All right. Um, so. For Medusa. He's now got... This. He could target center torso. Which is exactly 60 damage, 50% chance to hit it. Oh man, can we can we say no to this? I think we got to I think we got to try for it. Well, on the other hand, he, we've destroyed the AC-10, crit his laser. He doesn't have a lot left, but I kind of want to seal the deal. I like having these guys off the field. Let's give it a go. Center torso. He missed. He missed an 85% shot to the center torso. Medusa. What the actual crap? Oh. 
We've got some structure exposed on the left side here. We've got to turn him around. Got to turn him around. I'm waiting for orders. All right, we're coming up here. Coordinates received. We got to deal with this guy. We can't let him get up. Center torso. Let's go, Decker. Clutch. Clutch shots. Yeah, you got it. Now, if any of you guys are looking and it's like, oh man, you could have pilot killed him or you could get more salvage or stuff like that. Left arm destroyed, man. Ouch. Definitely got to turn him. Um, to be honest, I don't need the salvage on this mission. I only have like one of six anyways, so the likelihood that I'd get a full mech or, or multiple pieces of mech, very, very low. So I'm just worried about keeping our guys alive and slightly uninjured. Uh, luckily, there's nothing in that arm. <laughs> but it exposes his ammo, so we've got to turn that away. He's down pretty low. He's been taking a lot of damage. But we need to turn his right side to peeps. And uh, we need to do it fairly quickly. A uh, bunch of peeps going. Let's go ahead and reserve, Decker. Roger that. Standing by. Got this guy coming in. We still don't know what these two guys are. Oh, except that that guy's got an AC-5 and like an LRM-5. Might It should probably tell me what it is, but I can't think of it. Probably like a, well, it's a medium though, because it's going in phase three. Otherwise, I'd say maybe a commando or something like that, but. All right, buddy. Ready for orders. I need you. To move forward. Maybe like this. I mean, that's awful. Well, I kind of want to expose my right side, though, so... Let's uh let's do it. On my way. Oh, it's a Shadowhawk. And there's another mech out here. Holy crap. I thought they said one lance. This is two lances. Seven mechs? Six is it six mechs? We've killed two. We see four, so six mechs right now. That is nuts. Alright, man, light this guy up. Oh, first, I want to Vigilance you, and then light him up. Firing a full salvo. Another Shadowhawk. I mean, I've been sensor locked. Wait, what the freak? Oh. Is that Decker that he sensor locked? No. It's our guy here. Orders. Okay, feel like I gotta get him up here in the fight a little bit. Uh, well, I do have shots with everything from up here on that trebuchet. But I think I'd kinda like to give them something else to shoot at. And let's uh, could vigilance him as well. Or precision strike. What's your center looking like? <sighs> hmm. I 
like maybe have enough if everything hits there in the center. I mean, it would get him off the board and increase my chances of hitting him. 33% chance, though. Well, it might allow Glitch to kill him. Let's give it a go. Oh, yeah. We did some ouch on him. Wolverine. Okay. Large laser coming in. Okay. I can dig it. Well, Glitch, I want you to stand here. He's got two points there. Two! And then can we hit... Like, this guy's got his back to us. I feel like we just have to shoot him. But it says that she can't hit them. What's the point of indirect fire if I can't indirect fire? Alright. Fine. I will come over here. No, I will come... No. This thing I got I got like these lasers that I can't use on anybody. Oh, there I can use some lasers. There I could use some lasers. Alright, so we'll go here. No we won't. That's silly. What am I thinking? And it doesn't have jump jets. All right, we'll give this a go. I don't like the angle she has with the missiles on him, but I guess they're going to be indirect, so we don't have to do much. We just have to hit his friggin' torso, like, once. He's got two hit points. I think with 30 missiles, we got a good chance of hitting his center torso at least once. All right. Multi-target. Yep. And then you back here, Mr. Shadowhawk. I'm going to hit you with these lasers. Let's do it. You get a headshot, and you get a headshot. There it is. That's all we needed. <laughs> 30 missiles to do two damage. <laughs> Could have tried for 15, but, you know. What can you do? All right, so they have all gone, F I believe. Right? Three mechs, three gone, yes. So, Decker. What's up, boss? I need you. Can you get anywhere where you can actually shoot something? You can, right here. Oh, but you have to jump to do it. Sick. I do not want to do that. And you can't jump into trees. Ah. Uh, would really prefer not to have you do this. Okay, so what we're going to do instead, I'm going to move you over here.
my movie over here into these bushes. Because it's that Shadowhawk over here seems to be looking for you. Position confirmed. Uh, that's not going to do anything. Just brace. Turn's going to end. It's not going <laughs> to. It won't matter. Uh, now it kind of matters. Ready for orders. Now I can move you in and maybe shoot you. Have you shoot at somebody? Or Let's move you over this way. Not maximum pips, but it's a lot. We got other big mechs in the way. And then I'm going to have you sensor lock this guy. I've got a sensor lock. And then Sure Shot gets to go. Waiting for orders. He's gonna shoot this guy right in the face. All this goodiness. Acknowledged. Head hit pilot injured, I'm okay with that. Now he's like, uh, this was a bad idea. You got a head hit. You get a head hit. Everybody gets a head hit. Good to go. And with her, I think we can just stand here and kind of do the same thing we did before. We're going to give you the lerms and we're going to give you the lasers. Ammo explosion, head hit, pilot injured. Head hit, pilot injured. Man, injuries abound. You can't take much more of this. You're doing all right. Commander. Dusa. Can you hit this guy? Like, you've been missing a lot, and it's been kind of pissing me off. Um, ooh. Do I even want to shoot at him? He has one laser left. Or do I want to shoot at this guy? I can't shoot at that guy. Oh, that's got suck. Alright. Alright, we'll shoot at you. Roger that. Pilot incapacitated. Full Wolverine. <laughs> now this guy's like, hey, what's going on? Why are you guys blowing up all our friends? Because it was supposed to be Lance versus Lance, and you guys brought six. It's a douche move, guys. Super douche move. Wait a minute. We have killed four of these guys, and it says 33%. Uh, I don't like that at all. Are you kidding me? Oh, maybe 33% of the reinforcements. Okay. I'm okay with that. All right, Mr. Decca. Uh, what do I want to do with you? I want to reserve. I want these guys to do their thing. He's coming forward.
Yeah. Armor breach. That, Internal damage. That right side's taking punishment. Commander? How are you doing? Oh, that is your right side. That right side's hurting a lot. You're hurting a lot all over the place. Okay. We gotta... We gotta start doing something else with you. Yes, Commander. They both have a lot of stoof there. So... I hear ya. We're actually gonna start with Glitch. And she's gonna move up here. No, she's gonna move about here. What if I move you here? Same on the mediums. 55, 65, 65, where can I, like I gotta get way back here for better missiles, right? Oh no, 45. So missile wise, it's gonna be about the same no matter what. So might as well move you into the forest. We're going to multi-target. Oh, look at that head. In fact, I was going to... I was going to give them one, one lerm each, but I think with that head, we got to give them all of it. We've also got to take off some lasers. In fact, I'm going to take off all the lasers. Maybe one laser. One laser? Yeah, two lasers too much. One laser. Okay. Because uh, I need to... The reason for it is I need to strip their evasion. So, let's go. And she hit with a man. That's nice shooting, Tex. Wait a minute. Why is it moving again? Did he not already move? I could have swore they both had already moved. I guess not. Um, that's unfortunate. This guy, I don't think, has been hurt at all. This guy is actually quite in not a good spot. I'm ready. Is this his left side? Or his right side, I mean? Yes. All right, I'm taking this guy out right now. Could just punch him, but it's a center like. No, we'll do more damage if we fire. But get into the get into the woods, dude. You're moving here. Location confirmed. Yeah, let her rip. That. Standing by. So a Dusa here. Yeah, 
Yeah. Roger. There goes the knockdown. Did I kill the pilot? Yeah. We have so much mech salvage and we're not going to get like any of it. <laughs> it makes me sad. Yes, Commander. Decker! I would like you to come over here. I think if, if you move, so you can get a little further when you jump, but I'm I'm worried about your heat a bit. Copy that. Yep, this is the guy. In fact, I'm gonna. There's ammo in there? Yeah. Let's see if we can hit that. No. Close. But no. Hey, Deckard's return again! How crazy is that? Too bad we can't precision strike again. However... We can move you back into this wonderful rear arc. Yeah, right here. Confirmed. And I'd really like if you could just, you know, blow off that right torso. It would be really fun. I promise. Copy that. I don't think you hit that right torso at all. Yes, Commander. Nope. Oh, you hit a little bit. No, you didn't. You didn't hit it at all. You just hit this center torso. Which is okay. Because Sure Shot here is going to take Confirmed. a beating onto that thing. Well, there's the, there's the explosion. Solid connection on that one. Yeah. Hey, it's my turn again. This guy is like going on two for some reason. I think it's because he got Ready for orders. hurt or something. I don't know. Which means we really don't need to. Lifting off. I just want everything into that side. I want all that damage transfer into the center. You know it. Locked on. Unsteady. Oof. Waiting for order. That's tough. That's tough. Oh, what? Geothermal. Oh. Glitch. Your heat is going to be stupid. Alright, I want the... I want the lerms more than the, the lasers, because... Stability damage. Special delivery. Oh. Or you can just blow it up with the one laser that I gotcha. let you shoot. Nice mission. That was fun. Like, six mechs was a bit... I was a little scared. But, you know, we took a lot of damage on our Shadowhawk, but that's okay. That's what it's meant to do. Um, you saw how I exposed one side. They kind of took out that arm, and then I exposed the other side. 
They did a lot of damage. They got a lot of internals. But none of the other mechs got hurt. None of the pilots except for him got hurt. Um, and we didn't lose anything off of that arm. I don't think they crit anything and we lost it over here. It would have just been the medium laser. The main damage, though, comes from our SRMs, which are in our center kind of like area here. So really well performed. Didn't actually get any kills, but did what he was supposed to do. Soaked up a lot of damage. 2,000 XP for everybody, or was that 200? Couldn't tell. Look at all this mech salvage. Holy balls. I mean, that's a lot of mech salvage. Doesn't look like any special weapons. Oh, this AC-20. Do we have an AC-20? I don't know. Uh, we could go for the Centurion, because we already have a piece, but... We have a Centurion. I would be more tempted to either get the Hunchback or the Wolverine. Get one of those started. Probably the Hunchback more than anything. But with this AC-20. <coughs> and only one piece of salvage that we can pick up. Worth 180k. Hmm, I don't know. If we get a full hunchback, we get an AC-20 for free anyways. So, this is a this is actually a fairly tough choice. I wish I knew if we had one already or not. Um, like, I wish there was a thing here that showed how much you have. Like, it... It's for one, but you have this many in inventory. Uh, modders or harebrained, if you're watching this, note. This tells us how much, uh, if we have parts of mechs, tell us how many of these things that we have so we can choose. Um, I mean, ultimately, we can purchase AC-20s, I think, now, or at least soon. So, I think... Like, we have a full Shadowhawk we could have almost got. I think I'm going to prioritize the Hunchback. Or do I want the Wolverine? Wolverine's a heavier mech. But I think the 55 and the 60 tonners are not ideal. Let's look at its hard points. Tons of, of lasers. Tons of lasers ability there um the hunchback is specifically a ac20 hunchback i mean to be fair a hunchback is kind of a one-trick pony whereas the wolverine good durability yeah i changed my mind i'm gonna snag this wolverine uh we got all three parts of this oh how lucky would that be yeah, let's snag the Wolverine. Maybe we'll get lucky, get the other two pieces. Doubtful. Highly doubtful. But if we're lucky, we'll get the AC-20 as well. I mean, we only get five other pieces of salvage, so let's go with that. We got a full Shadowhawk. Are you kidding me? <laughs> well, I guess there was like three of them out there, so. Okay. Uh, Didn't get the AC-20. Didn't get any more Wolverines, but we got a full Shadowhawk. Call it a good day. <laughs> what are the odds of that? Oh, probably better than I think, but still. <laughs> oh, not bad. Not bad. Probably a long mission. It's probably going to be a long episode, but uh, that was fun. That was a fun mission. Battle mission. And asked for. For I didn't ask for that one. I asked for the other one. But we'll take it. Uh, so here, look at that. We could scrap it for half a million, basically. But I think we could do that at any time. And our current Shadowhawk is like tore up. 
but we'd have to refit this with the the missiles and stuff and yeah um i think what we could do let's do maybe send our blackjack to storage or scrap our blackjack i'm gonna store it i'm gonna store our blackjack um not because we need the money or don't need the money, but that's our ancestral mech. Okay, we're gonna hold on to that black Drake forever. That's a bit of that's the last piece of our family history that we have. So let's do that. Um, all right, now we've got some peeps out. Look at that. Three people are out for twelve days, thirteen days. Our quick draws and projects. We've got to go somewhere else. I don't think we have any more contracts here. If we do, even no. Okay. So taking the bait. Where is this? Kimi, Kimi. These are both in Kimi. So that's another battle. That's another battle. Ugh. In the desert. That sounds awful. The Badlands. Also hot. This is just a hot place to go. Um. So let's do this. Let's take a look. Where's navigation? Now that we can go anywhere we want to, let's take a look at our star map here. There's travel contracts here at Kimi, but we don't have to go there. Um, we can go anywhere we want to. We just have to pay the cost. The, the contracts will pay for us to go. Um, it also gives us kind of the average challenge, I think. Medium moons token population. See, I'm not sure what all these attributes actually. Desert world. We don't want to go any desert worlds, that's for sure. I think it said to stay out of like some of the bigger areas. Like we could go here. <laughs> Uh, Mandalas, Agriculture, Tropical World. You can also see, also see which governments are kind of in that area. Token Population. How do I... Like, move the map around. It wasn't really... Oh, okay. Just click and move. Battlefield. I'm looking for something like a... I think I saw, like, there's, like, black markets and things in some places. Oh, here we go. Mega City. Lots of stuff here. Black Market. Goods, weapons, even battle mechs. It's rich, so probably get some good contracts there. It's going to take us 27 days. Clough's Stand, it's called. Terran World. Clough's Stand. Terran World. Aquaculture manufacture like this place has seems to have a lot going for it so let's head over there um capellan planetary government magistracy of the magistracy likes us so i, th I like that oops uh clough stand yes so we're gonna go there oh before we go there we're going to look at the store one last time yeah, see, we can buy AC-20s, and they're fairly cheap. Um, we got a 5% discount here, but so I'm not worried about that. Large laser, LRM-20s. It's from 2 for damage, but it's a 2. Arm mod. 
plus 20 melee damage, but it's four tons. Oh my gosh. I mean, it would make a shadow hawk like super beefy, but holy crap. Four tons for this arm mod. It's cheap. Let's buy it just in case we want it. Um, don't think we need to purchase an AC-20. Like here too. Like in the, the, the thing. I need to know how many of these I have. I don't want to have to go to the mech bay and then look and see. Uh, Lerm's here at the system store in Wildry. So we just got to remember that if we want stuff, we can come, like, just basic stuff, we can come to Weldry and buy it. I think that's sufficient. Uh, Mech Bay. Let's go in here. Let's get all, get everything prepped up. Because we're going to be traveling for, like, 20 days. Uh, oh, poor Shadowhawk. You got, you got herded a lot. But we didn't lose anything. So it shouldn't actually take that much time yeah we've got 11 days no problem uh is there anything we want to change on anything we've got this other shadow hawk we could theoretically fit it out like our other one just so that if this one ever gets uber damaged since it's taken a lot of the hits we can just swap it out not a terrible idea. Uh, our Centurion. I think we already f messed with him and we were trying him out a little bit with some of this stuff. Um, I don't mind the AC-10. I think it, it works. It's worked pretty good for us. I just need to remember to try and get him in a little closer. There's no minimum range. He's a, He's got to be a bit more brawly than what we've been doing with him. Um, you know what else I could do with this? I could turn this into something that is a little bit better for glitch. <coughs> Two SRM2s? Is this a different variant? <laughs> I don't know. It might be. Like, take off all of this stuff. Um, like, let's just strip it out. All right, we got jump checks and we got some heat sinks. The heat efficiency right now is amazing, but that's to be expected. So, if we want to keep her as like a lerm thing, oh, we have no lerms. We'll have to buy some lerms. But we could. Oh, when did we get this? AC 20 plus plus with damage and stability? Holy crap. Where has this been? I mean, this could be a whole different type of... Oh, it's so expensive, though. Or heavy. Look how heavy this is. 14 tons. Ugh. It has enough room for that. <laughs> Two tons of ammo. And then maybe... Let's see, two tons of ammo, two medium lasers. That would still be a fairly beasty Shadowhawk, man. But look at the armor. The armor is so low on it right now. We would basically have to... This would be like a, a poor man's hunchback. Or maybe a big man's hunchback, because I think a hunchback's only a 50 ton. Uh, we could afford to take off a ton of these heat sinks. Like all of them. Man, I didn't even remember that we had this. See, now this is actually something we, we may want to fit to that Centurion. K-1 
cancel all this. Revert. Go back. Uh, this Centurion here is a lighter mech. But we've got the armor geared up to infinity. The only thing is it's in its arm, and I hate putting an AC-20 in an arm because it's so easy to get lost. It's so easy for, for that. You know what? I've got an idea. I am going to build out this Shadowhawk. Uh, it is a different model. It's a 2D instead of a 2H. Yeah, it's got different weapon loadouts. It's actually meant more for um, laser vomit than missiles and ballistics. This poor guy. Uh, so let's do this. Let's take a look at this guy. Let's just strip out the equipment and let's build this like we're going to make it this crazy AC-20 Goobler. Uh, we're going to have at least two tons of AC-20 ammo or AC-2 ammo. Um, this is filler just for tonnage sake. Okay. Then, I want armor. I want armor, armor, armor. So, like, armor here. Armor here. Armor here. Armor here. Let's take it up to 50. Uh, we've got to boost its leg armor. Aren't you doing anything? Okay. Uh, we got to boost its arm armor up to 60s, I think. All right, so you're looking at kind of like the minimum armor I want to do. 53 tons. Okay. So in that case, can we go pew, pew. Our heat efficiency is still good. We do basically 160 damage with an alpha. We have no jump jets. Hmm. Okay, let's back off on some of the armor here. We're a little bit crazy with some of our, our shoulder armor here. That would let us put one jump jet on. No. This can have up to five jump jets. That's two and a half tons we would need. Okay, I want a hundred there. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth putting jump jets on. Instead, I think what we do is we I think we add a second ton of ammo or a third laser. And I actually like the idea of the third laser maybe. Our heat efficiency really goes down with third laser though. I mean, I want 10 shots. That's that's a given. There has to be 10 shots. Um, at the minimum. 
That really bumps up our heat, though. But. Man. We could afford to go a little bit down on some of our leg armor, maybe. Maybe down a little bit on our torso. Maybe our head just a smidge. What's this? Ammo that I can't use. That's fine. But our heat efficiency bad. And actually, my thought was that we have some heat efficient mechs that we can take out on desert things. So, with this, we could throw on another ton of ammo. Another ton of ammo, which will let it go a little bit longer. That would give it 15 shots instead of 10 shots. 15 shots, though. I don't know that we need 15 shots. So maybe we just armor the crap out of it. Put on a ton of, a ton of armor. I mean, we could put on two jump jets, but I don't think that would actually do anything for it. Like two jump jets? Uh, I think this thing needs five to get around. So I think we make it a, a lumbering, cool um, dealy one. And now I've got to revert all this crap because I need that extra ton of ammo. So I'm going to fit this guy out. Um, we oh, This video has been going on forever. I'm going to fit this guy out, and then um, I will be back with you guys next time. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, tap the like button. If you didn't, uh, feel free to tap the dislike button. Um, either way, leave me a comment down below. Tell me why you liked or disliked. And um, if you haven't already and want to, feel free to subscribe for more content. But until next time, I've been Shadowblade. You guys stay sharp.